What's up, OCC gang? What's up, y'all? I am chilling so hard right now. I'm pretty sure you can see that. Like, I am chilling so hard. This video, y'all will see it tonight. I'm basically um, just going to put it up. Um, I was in my One Cute Couponer group, my Facebook group, and I saw a couple people posting pictures of the Walmart candy clearance and I definitely wanted to share. Like I knew the candy clearance was going on because I did videos about it in previous, you know, last year I did a bunch of videos and the year before I did a video about the Walmart candy clearance. So it's pretty much that season again and I knew the clearance was about to happen, but I didn't want to encourage people to go to the store. But now that I see people in the group in Walmart anyway, I'm like, wow, y'all are shopping anyway. So here's the thing. A lot of people are saying, oh, stay home, stay home. You don't need to go out for anything. But I forgot to account for the people who actually have to go out for groceries. And while you are going out and you're standing at the checkout in these long lines, you can look for the candy. So I was thinking people should stay home. They should be staying home. I don't want to encourage people to go out, but I completely forgot to account for those of you who are going to the grocery store. When you get paid, you're standing in that line anyway. You're standing right next to this clearance candy anyway. It's not like you have to go around the store looking for it. If you find it, it's going to be right at the checkout. And I completely forgot about that until I saw some of you posting in the One Q Couponer Facebook group. So shout out to y'all. You know exactly who you are. Y'all have been getting so much of this clearance candy from Walmart. So in this video, since I'm not going to the store, I'm really sad about that, but I'm not too worried. I have like over a hundred candy bars left from the last clearance. So in this video, I'm going to do what we do. I'm going to put barcodes on the screen and you guys already know what to do. Get your phones ready to scan these barcodes and it will tell you what's in stock at your store. Now, if you're not familiar with how my videos work and how to scan clearance, don't worry. You can click right at the top of the screen right now. Click that video. I'm going to put it up in the cards right up there. Go ahead and click it. And it will lead you to a video showing you exactly how to scan on your screen so that you can get these same deals. All right, and remember, if you can't scan from your phone because you're watching on your phone, I get people saying that a lot, I'm gonna show you a quick way that you can actually search on your phone if you can't use your phone to scan. So guys, let's get into it and have fun getting that candy only if you're going to the store anyway. If you didn't have plans to go out, don't go out, stay home. No, I'm definitely getting the last one. Okay, I didn't see these at all at the other store. This looks like a weird flavor. Twix triple chocolate. And when I'm looking for candy clearance, I always look for seasonal flavors that have been out and didn't sell well. I'm gonna go ahead and scan these, pull up that barcode. Scan, scan, scan. Let's see. Oh my gosh. These are 25 cents. These are only 25 cents. I'm getting them all. I'm getting them all. I have to get all of them. Right, guys? Okay, what would you do? 25 cents for Twix? And it says they were $1.34 before? I have to get them all. I'm not leaving them on the shelf. So I went a little crazy. I went, maybe I went a lot crazy. Look, this is insane. This is so insane, but guess what? I'm not paying for any of it with my own money. I'm using my Walmart gift card that I got from Fetch Rewards, and that's gonna make most of this hopefully free for me. So if you wanna learn how to do this, first you're gonna need the Walmart app. And I'm just gonna show you really quickly how you can just even type in names of candy. I just typed in Dove 100 calories. That's one of the bars. And I'm just gonna go on the At Your Store tab. You wanna be on the At Your Store tab, and you can see that at my store in Birmingham, the price on these it's 10 cents. So it's that easy. You can type in names of different candies or you can try typing in UPCs and make sure you're on the right tab. If you're on the walmart.com tab, it's not going to work for you. You have to be on the tab that says at your store. So you can type in names of candies or you can type in UPCs. Now on the screen, I'm about to show you tons of UPCs. And if you can't scan from your phone because you're watching the video on your phone, you can type in the UPCs, write them down. Write the UPCs down and then go to the Walmart app and input the UPCs and check it out. It will show you if that candy is on sale at your store. Now, if you want to change stores and see if another store has it cheaper, then go ahead and click where it says change. Right next to the address of the store, there will be a selection that says change. You can select that 
and just change your store. You can see which store near you actually has this. And then when you're planning your shopping trip, let's say you need to go get diapers, you have to go get baby formula, or you're going to the store, you need milk, whatever it is that you need, go ahead and choose to go to the store that has what you need in terms of candy. Now, I typed in M&Ms. I don't know why it's not showing M&Ms at the top, but I typed in M&Ms and you can see that they have some M&Ms. Some of the stores have the M&Ms. So when I don't see it at the store that I want, I just change the store and check it out. This store actually has the M&Ms for 25 cents. So just change stores as you need to, to see which store has what you need. But remember guys, and this time let's be considerate and only go out if you need to go out. If you don't need to go out and you're not going to re-up on groceries, I encourage you to stay home. But again, I cannot judge you but I encourage you to stay home. So I typed in a UPC this time instead of typing in M&Ms and check it out. These peanut butter chocolate candy singles came up for only 25 cents and we know the regular price on those is not 25 cents. But again, you can type in the word if you want to. This time I typed in Skittles and check it out. There are Skittles clearance for 50 cents. Guys, so you will find candy depending on where you live. It might be 10 cents, it might be 25 cents, and it might be 50 cents. It all depends on where you live. So you can type in the name of the candy or you can type in the UPC. So when you see the barcodes pop on the screen and they're about to start coming on the screen, when you see the barcodes, it's time to scan. So go ahead and pull out your phone and pull out the Walmart app. And when you see these barcodes come on the screen, get ready to start scanning. Over yet, she's got more deals to show you. When you want to try it, but you don't want to buy it, she got the deal of the day. Say, hey, 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 let's go to Target. Use our body if you really, really want a digi coupons all the reach. Get the body, clip the page like Naomi Campbell. We're shutting down the aisle. Get the deals to make your yet she's got more deals to show you when you want to try it but you don't want to buy it she got the deal of the day say hey 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 let's go to target use our body if you really really want a digi coupons all the reach get the final clip the page like naomi campbell we're shutting down the aisle get the deals to make your
up. This ain't over yet. She's got more deals to show you. When you wanna try it, but you don't wanna buy it, she got the deal of the day.